that brought warmth and friendliness to you. She was extremely kind. She would always be there to extend the hand of friendship to anybody. Soccer visible were some of the, the realest people I knew to care for because it's just who they were. Just a few of the many things friends and family will remember about Sandra Enriquez and Isabel Enriquez. They were murdered last week. Sandra was 43. Her daughter Isabel was just 15. They were taken far too soon. Among the hundreds in the crowd was Nando Enriquez. He survived the attack. Addressing the public for the very first time, he spoke softly. Last two while still young, he left the crowd with these words of wisdom. I just hope that every one of us can just cherish every time we spend this time with those that you love, because you never know when that can take from you. Now, many people in the community say they'll take Nando under their wings. I think the biggest way that we can support him is just coming alongside of him, being there for him when he needs somebody to talk to, being somebody to listen to, just being a friend to him. Now, Hernando Enriquez Sr. is charged with the murder of Sandra and Isabel and the attempted murder of Nando. He is now behind bars and being held without bond. Now, if you would like to help out Nando, the church has set up a fund. We've got more on our website on how you can help him out on kgun9.com. Kevin?